Look at what kind of a grasshopper he is. He is a chubby grasshopper. Read it. Look, what do you think chubby means? Does he look chubby? Let's look, Landon. Let's take a pic peek at him. Chubby. What's a chubby grasshopper? We're going to see if this character comes back. Riley, what do you think you have in your hand? An eagle. He is an eagle. You're right. He's an eagle. In our story, he's going to be a different kind of a bird. He's going to be a hawk. Do you see him in there? So we're going to pretend that eagle's a hawk. You're right. Can I hold the hawk for a minute? Thanks. Thanks. Look at his face. Oh, his heart was gray. What's wrong? Oh, Mason, what do you think? It was gray. Do you think he was really happy? Sad. Oh, maybe sad. Maybe he was feeling sad. Why? Okay. Why? Did you hear? Anna, Anna says, why? Why were they sad? They did not have the energy. A lot required. Going a short distance had left them quite tired. <gasps> uh oh, he's coming. Eagle. The hawk, the hawk is coming. Look, here he comes. You are both so plump, the hawk said with a grin. Plump? What does that mean? They've been eating. They've been eating a lot all day, and now they're looking plump. What do you think plump means? They've been eating so much. Look. Puffed up and Nathan, what do you think plump means? They're all puffed up and plump. They ate too much. And they're really plump. Do you think they're skinny or do you think they're fat and chubby? So one day, Grasshopper decided he really missed hopping. At least without stopping. Look at Grasshopper, Anna. He starts to go hop.
love some. Maybe we should try it. Your friends affect you and you affect them. We're all connected. Grasshoppers, snakes, hawk, and men. In this beautiful life, there is no one size fits all. Some are round, some are thin, others are short, others tall. But it's never our size that others adore, but what's on the inside and what's in our core. There goes Grasshopper. Anna, show me how you have him with his energy now. He smiled. He has lots of energy and he woke up. It helped improve his blue mood. He's not blue and sad anymore. Oh, Riley put the cupcake on there. Oh, maybe you show, show me. Can you draw or write about what did Grasshopper look like when he ate the cupcake? Show me what he looked like when he eats her cupcake. Let's see. We'll see if he's looking chubby. He says, but, oh, look, I see his round body. What should, what should Grasshopper eat to make him feel healthy? Maybe some grass. All right, Riley looks like she's drawing some grass. All right, show me what Grasshopper looks like after he eats his grass. How does he feel now? He feels fine. He feels better. Yes, I see your experiment. You haven't. They too felt renewed and truly happy. He's even happy. Show me what he looks like when he's happy and filled with glee. Can you show me a picture of Grasshopper looking happy and filled with glee? He means really happy and joyful. Here, Anna, you can do a new one. You can show me what Grasshopper looks like when he's happy and healthy. Always a smiley face. I can tell that's happy. You don't think so? What do you think Grasshopper would look like? Show Anna where it looks like he drew the made of happy. So he always looks happy. Look, Riley, look at the end. He has a smiley face, and he does look like your picture, that grasshopper. And he looks happy and healthy. But what is it? Is it What do you think? Well, let's listen. Let's go back and see the words if it says. Oh, look, it said, grasshopper was hopping and free. He smiled upon Winky. He smiled. Do you think he is a boy or a girl? He's a mouse. He. He. So, so if you say he, you mean he's a boy. Yeah, so that grasshopper was a boy. Yeah, he smiled. And if it was a bird, it would be a Oh, he kind of looks like a girl with his eyelashes on there. He does. Oh, and smile. And he's smiling. Look, this picture must not have been when he was chubby and feeling yucky at the end because I do see him smiling. Look. Hey, Dad. Uh, Riley? And at the look end. Look at him. He looks like a girl. He looks happy and healthy. He looks like a girl, Riley. What do you think, Trent? Oh, he does. He does. He agrees. Yep. He was stopped eating all those cookies and cakes and his body feels better. Look at what he looks like with that cupcake picture that Landon drew for us. And he found, oh, look, he's got his big fat shoes, and he can hardly have, look, he's thinking. Do you see those dots? And up here, that's a thought bubble. That means he's thinking about something. He's thinking about when he was healthy, and he could hop all around without being tired. And his body is heavy. Yeah, he's really happy. Why, why, why did he just eat it? Not a cupcake. Maybe he another cupcake. Maybe because he gave it to her neighbor. Maybe somebody gave it to him and he just wanted to eat it. Maybe his neighbor. So what do you think will happen at the end? Now, now the grasshopper is healthy and he's not eating any more sweets. What do you think he'll do next? Maybe the grasshopper gave it to him and the snake or maybe. And listen, listen to my question. Now the grasshopper got healthy again. The teacher almost took this away. Listen, Anna, now that he's healthy, what do you think he'll do? What do you think he'll do next? Riley doesn't think he'll eat any more cupcakes. She thinks he'll continue to be healthy. What do you think, Anna? Maybe grass or flowers.
Maybe he'll just keep eating grass and flowers. It sounds like you think he's going to be healthy too. Eating the grass. You were right. You were right. He was eating the grass. This one says green. You need the word green. And you were right on the book if you wanted to write grasshopper's name. The words say the chubby grasshopper. There's the word grasshopper. You want to write that word. Yeah, you can write on this paper, sweetie. Yeah, don't. You're right. Don't write on the book. You write on the paper. I just wanted to show you if you need to write any of the words, they're right here so you can see what they look like. Yeah, that's for you to use. Okay, Ryan. Yep. Alright, write his name. Can you have anyone you want? He has lots of energy now. Sure it does. We need another paper